Here is an easy way to create this halftone leader effect in Photoshop. Load up the image you want to use and convert it to a smart object. Then create a new layer by hitting the plus icon here. Then go to edit, fill and fill it with 50% gray. Then hit OK. Duplicate this layer by hitting Ctrl J and hide the top layer for now. Select the middle layer, then go to Filter, Camera Row Filter, then go to Effects and set the grain to 100% and the roughness to about 80%. Then hit OK. Set the blending mode to Overlay, select and enable the top layer and convert it to a smart object. And make sure your foreground and background colors are set to black and white. Then go to Filter, Filter Gallery. In the Sketch folder, Apply reticulation and set the density to 40, the foreground level to 15, and the background level to 3. Then hit the plus icon here to apply a new effect layer. Then select the half tone pattern. Set the size to 2 or 3. Depending on the size of your image, you may need a higher or lower number. But 2 or 3 should be good. And for the contrast, set it to 11 and the pattern type set it to dot. Then hit OK. Then set the layer to overlay. Your image should look like this, and if not, click Filter Gallery here and adjust the size value depending on your size image. Then hit OK. Select all layers by selecting the bottom layer and hitting Shift and selecting the top layer. Then convert them to a smart object. Then go to Adjustment and add the threshold layer. Move the slider till your image is neither too dark or too bright. In my case, I'm gonna do 70%. Go to Adjustment and add a gradient map layer. Then add a gradient of your liking. I'll go with this one. And you're done. If this tutorial was helpful, make sure to subscribe and comment what effect I should cover next. And I'll see you next time.